Okay, so here is some default behavior for Revit war, in Revit for Warren trusses, which may cause some users to scratch their heads a little bit and uh, may cause some frustration, but I'm going to show you real quick how you can get around that. So Warren Truss out of the box. What I'm going to do here is I'm just going to change one of the level offsets here because it's sloping. And when I do, notice that as soon as I do that, the bottom course extends to be of the same length as the top course, which in many cases is not desired. So how to fix that? Um, well, what you do is put some reference planes a reference planes at the work points make sure that that's uh, or wherever the the bottom truss needs to essentially stop and then go in here use your cut geometry tool select the bottom cord select the reference plane select the bottom cord select the reference plane and then you're back to where you were um, editing the profile is not going to work for you uh, there's some other things that you might think of, but that seems to be about the best workflow to quickly make that adjustment for those sloping worn trusses.